<laughs> when Martin Lawrence was in that chair, we talked about Blue Streak. Yes, I love that. Too. He played a role in your life, I believe. How do you feel about him as a person, as an artist? Martin Lawrence is the guy that showed everybody you can make it from D.C. to Hollywood. And uh, I had a personal stake in his success. Every time he did something, it made me feel inspired and really good. And he was always real nice to me. He'd sit me down, what's going on with you, baby boy? What, what? We'd talk about comedy, whatever. And, uh, you know, when we did Blue Streak, we were promoting it, you know, and Martin had a stroke. He almost died. And then after that, I saw him, and I was like, oh, my God, Martin, are you okay? And he said, I got the best sleep I ever got in my life. <laughs> That's how tough he is. So let me ask you this. What is happening in Hollywood that a guy that tough will be on the street waving a gun, screaming, they are trying to kill me? Yeah. What's going on? Why is Dave Chappelle going to Africa? Why does Mariah Carey make a $100 million deal and take clothes off on TRL? It, a weak person cannot get to sit here and talk to you. There ain't no weak people talking to you. So what is happening in Hollywood? Nobody knows. The worst thing to call somebody is crazy, is dismissive. I don't understand this person, so they're crazy. That's bullshit. These people are not crazy. They're strong people. Maybe the environment is a little sick.